The Earl of Arndell is a portrait of Thomas Howard, the second Earl of Arndell. It was painted by Peter Paul Rubens. The painting was painted in 1630. Isabella Stewart Gardner brought it and placed it inside a museum inside the Dutch room. The Earl of Arndell was a powerful man. He was born in 1585. He served King Charles I until the Earl suffered a humiliating defeat in 1638. Then he retired to the Netherlands. He then died in Italy in 1646. He was good friends with Peter Paul Rubens. They somehow lost contact and their friendship diminished. In 1629 to 1630, the Earl and Rubens renewed their friendship while Rubens went to London on a diplomatic mission. Rubens visited the Earl's house where the Earl had collected a lot of impressive sculptures and paintings. Rubens enjoyed looking at the Earl's paintings. Rubens had painted the Earl's wife back in 1620, so Rubens decided to paint the Earl also. Peter Paul Rubens was a pretty famous painter. Rubens was born on June 28th of the year 1577 in Germany. He was a prolific artist. He painted mostly about religious scenes or paintings of history. Some of the major works he's done that also catch my eye are his paintings of the Duke of Lerma, where he depicts the Duke standing, a, uh, sitting on a horse with a battle going on in the background. He must have been a very good painter to be requested by people of such stature. He, in this painting, he makes the Duke of Lerma look truly epic. Rubens is also known for many of his other works, on one being the elevation of the cross where he depicts Jesus nailed to a cross being raised by a bunch of men.